कम बात वीर का जोश था और नीवीर जैसा जोश था मुझे रेडी है ठीक है यहाँ से पूरे ऊपर करो हाथ को They come from all parts of the country but what is common among them is the passion the dedication and the motivation to serve in the Indian army I have with me Agnivir who have in fact begun training just in the month of January aap kahan se ho aur aapka naam kya hai aur I am ji hum I am from Tamil Nadu Kerala nearby Okay and uh, did you think you will always join the army what was your motivation there motivation what is your inspiration to join Inspiration. All of the Indian Army soldiers. We're proud of Indian Army. And at my child, our childhood time. And. आप लेने हैं इंग्लिश लेना वरना नहीं चिंतु निगा. हाँ, of course, ma'am. Okay. Tell me, आप कहाँ से हो? मैं अग्निवीर पंकज सिवारी, मध्य प्रदेश के जिला रीवा से रहने वाला हूँ. और आप पहले से ही आर्मी जवान बनना चाहते थे कौन आपका इंस्पिरेशन रहा क्या बैकग्राउंड रहा मैम गांव में ऐसे तो हमारे सीनियर जो भैया लोग थे वो अग्निवीर में, में इंडियन आर्मी में पहले से थे उनकी कॉम्बेट देख के अच्छा लगता था कि मैं भी जाऊं और अग्निपथ स्कीम आई जिसकी वजह से हम यहाँ हैं आज तो अच्छा लग रहा है प्रोग्राम तो शुरू हो चुकी है लेकिन जो आपने सोचा था वैसे वाला रेगर है की कुछ ज्यादा ही है जी मिस मैं नॉर्मल जैसे मतलब हमने ऐसे सोचा नहीं था कि इतना अच्छा होगा लेकिन बहुत अच्छा है हमें सीखने को बहुत मिल रहा है वेपन ट्रेनिंग और जो ड्रिल वगैरह है वो बहुत अच्छी बात है जो हम ई में आए और आगे भी ऐसे मतलब अच्छे करेंगे 25 परसेंट में आना चाहेंगे आप कहाँ से हो नाम क्या मुंबई महाराष्ट्र आई एम अग्निवीर सम, पाटिल समय निंगप्पा अच्छा पहली बार यहाँ पे वेपन पकड़ने का मौका मिला आप कहाँ से हैं क्या लगा कैसे दिमाग में क्या लगा मैडम हमारा बचपन से सपना था कि हम सोल्जर बने तो यहाँ पे पहली बार वेपन पकड़ा तो लगा कि हमारा सपना पूरा हो गया है बाकी मैं राजस्थान अजमेर से हूँ अग्निवीर अमन चौहान और आ, पहले दिन से ही शायद स्केड्यूल ऐसा ही रहा और आगे भी और टफ ही होने वाला है उसके लिए आपको लगता है की आपकी मेंटली तैयारी है जी मेंटली बिल्कुल तैयार है हमारा बचपन से सपना था तो हमने बचपन से तैयारी इसी तरीके से की है और बाकी फिजिकली तो हम पहले से तैयार है मतलब ये हमारी एक्सपेक्टेशन से बियॉन्ड है मतलब हमने सोचा था कि ये में आके एक नया एक्सपीरियंस मिला तो एक्सपीरियंस तो मिला ही बाकी यहाँ का जो एनवायरनमेंट मिला है ना वो तारीफ है 
इसके कर सकते हैं बाकी यहाँ की और चीज़ें बढ़िया लगी हैं स्पोर्ट्स मिल रहा है स्पोर्ट्स में अगर कोई बंदा बढ़िया है तो उसको अलग से मिल रहा है कि आप स्पोर्ट्स में अच्छा कर सकते हैं बाकी पी टी है ड्रिल्स हैं गेम्स वगैरह भी हैं यहाँ की प्रैक्टिकल क्लासेस भी होती हैं थ्योरिकल के साथ ही थ्योरिकल तो करा ही दिया है वहाँ की प्रैक्टिकल दिया है उसके साथ सेपरेट टाइम भी दे दिया है शाम को आप पढ़ सकते हैं आराम से स्टडी टाइम भी है शेड्यूल इस टाइप से सेट है कि आपको हर टाइम मिल रहा है आपको अपने लिए पर्सनल टाइम है पर्सनल लाइफ जींस भी है स्टडी टाइम भी है ऑल गो घर की याद आती है आप कहाँ से हो గుర్తుస్తూ ఉంటది మ్యామ్ కానీ ఇక్కడ ఉన్న ఫ్రెండ్స్ తో ఇంకా అలా అంతగా ఓమ్స్ కనిపించదు అనిపించదు ఇట్స్ ది కైండ్ ఆఫ్ ఈథోస్ ద పర్హాప్స్ దట్ గైడ్స్ మెనీ ఆఫ్ దిస్ యంగ్స్టర్స్ హు కమ్ విత్ లాట్స్ ఆఫ్ డ్రీమ్స్ ఇన్ देयर ఐస్ థింకింగ్ పర్హాప్స్ దట్ దే ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు అచీవ్ సంథింగ్ బియాండ్ వాట్ देयर లైఫ్ వుడ్ హావ్ अदरवाइज गिवन देम ఇన్ देयर విలेजेस అండ్ देयर टाउन्स అండ్ సిటీస్ ఫ్రమ్ देयर దే అరైవ్ హియర్ నౌ రెడీ ఫర్ ద ట్రైనింగ్ ఆఫ్ 31 వీక్స్ 10 weeks of the basic training after which the rest of it will be for specialization training in fact at the electronics and mechanical engineering center here in nasikandrabad i have with me spokesperson from the ministry of defense bharat bhushan uh, babu garu uh, who is an adg uh, there were several apprehensions when this uh, in fact came up this entire uh, agnivir exercise when it started there were many doubts that were raised one of them being that if uh, after 4 years you are going to be uh, dropping perhaps 75% of them army needs to be a cohesive unit i would reckon that competition between the people is that something that concerns you you know don't look at it as a dropping 75% you see uh, as someone has just pointed out uh, what will happen to them uh, when after they retire so why are you saying that they are retiring at the age of 25 you see they are joining at the age of 18 19 20 21 and by the time they complete their uh, stint with uh, us the army navy and air force they would hardly be 23 24 25 during these 4 5 years what they are getting actually they are being trained trained in certain traits uh, fighting capabilities plus values moral values and values about the national pride how to live for the other person how to you know protect the other one so when they go out they are going to be a better individual and compared to any other graduate or even uh, 12th class or technically qualified they have all the qualities not just in terms of a uh, human uh, value training but also uh, weapons and other core values by which a person should live so the what industry or the society the economy needs and what they provide will be a perfect match so we don't look at as you know there is any competition or it is going to be anything that anyone needs to be worried about the age of induction does it necessarily go down now they say 17 and a half is the age at which they are coming in do they have the maturity to handle all the kind of stresses that this kind of rigorous training because obviously our uh, uh, kind of compressing the entire training in a shorter period of time it's a voluntary uh there is you know no, i'm saying they themselves the, uh, compressing the training itself i'm saying you have to pack in a lot because they are uh, youngsters who you're putting through a ro- lot of rigor and you have obviously uh, you no. know had a selection process through which you can kind of uh, you have shortlisted them but are they too young for it or you find that it is a good enough age and it actually makes them you have a younger army so more fit army what 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 has been your experience in the last one hour or so you have seen and met them uh, they are the most capable and loving you know wonderful youth from all over the country as brigadier suresh sir mentioned you know this seven months training is going to focus on what we are expecting them in the first four five years of their service so uh, we don't see any extra stress in fact they are going it is going to be fun uh, for them and for the trainers as he has been saying the last two years because of corona there has been very little activity here so there is a lot of josh 
not only among the youth who have come from all over the country, but also among the staff who are going to train them. So it's a, it's a, it's a you know wonderful atmosphere here. Don't have any apprehension. So the um, program itself has been curated specifically to deal with uh, yes. uh, the kind of agni waves that we are having, uh, Brigadier Suresh. Yeah, yeah, yes, uh, the program is a well structured program, well thought of, outcome oriented, and optimum training oriented syllabus, and accordingly the institutes have been trained. And secondly, their capability to fight a war during the basic military training and for the technical training thereafter is well thought of and it will be a quantified outcome of the training that I can assure you. Thank you. And uh, many of those youngsters that we interacted with, they in fact told us that so many in our village wanted, only few of us got selected. In fact, there is a lot of uh, demand in that sense to want to come and serve in the Indian Army. Oh, that, that is the, that is the, that is the, the, the vibes uh, you are also getting, I am also getting. As a commandant or the training center is concerned, it is a, a honor to receive these boys for the Agni view. And you can see, just one week, I am telling you, it's just seven days are over. And if you come to us after about four months or so, you can see the how they will be. And I am sure uh, we will deliver and I will deliver a soldier and fighting fit to win the war. Thank you so much. Thank you. So the, uh, the centre and the programme very, very well curated in order to try and make it the most efficient training program possible so that the outcomes are, uh, as they say, battle ready and ready to serve the country through the Indian Army. In Hyderabad, with camera person Nagraju, Umasudhi, TV.